Smith v. Cumming, United States Court of Appeals, 11th Circuit. The First Amendment protects the right to gather information about what public officials do on public property and specifically a right to record matters of public interest. Hey, officer, how are you? Uh, what's going on today? Officer, what's your name? Barber. Officer Barber, you're yes, Quincy? Uh, I yes, thought they called county. They uh, called both of us. I'm just out here taking photos out in public, that's all. Uh, the prison? Yes, sir. Are you taking the inmates? Yeah, there's inmates right there. I saw them watching this vehicle. Are you taking pictures of? I'm a journalist gathering content for stories. It's investigative journalism. You got a ID on it? Uh, what type of ID would you mean? Driver's license, any type of ID. Uh, what's your name and date of birth? Well, let me, let me explain to you. I'm standing on a public sidewalk, taking photos out in public. And that's fine, I asked you for your ID. I understand, but if I'm not being detained, I'm not going to produce any identification. Well, sir, you need to move along there. Like you said, this is city property, so you need to move along. Uh, city right away. What would happen if I don't move along? You go to jail. For what? For what? Yes. Because I've asked you to move along. You're taking pictures of a facility that Is that illegal, though? We don't they, know if you're staging a breakout. I'm not staging a breakout. I told you I'm a journalist and gathering. This, and at this point, it, it's loitering because I asked you for ID and you can't produce it. You had to produce it. I'm not really. taking pictures of, of a facility that, that houses inmates. Right. I've, I've explained to you I'm an investigative journalist and gathering I, content for story. And your ID short. And I'm a, I'm, I have no, I'm no obligation to prove to you who I am. I'm, I'm, yes, you do. Am I, look, you, if hey. I'm not being detained, well, I'm, I'm going to say. Have a nice day. You have a nice day, too. You're free to go. 13 to 109, if you could, be in rock, please. Do you, are you what actually? Are you, over there? are you trying to trespass me from the public sidewalk? No, I'm asking you to walk along. Keep moving. Uh, I, I'm not gonna keep moving. I got a job to do, so that's I'm out here to do my job. I, I appreciate if you didn't I I appreciate if you didn't interfere and obstruct my drive. with my rights. Barbara was just rolled out with them. We wall connection with our caller, Quincy PD, has a unit. I thought I didn't see the fucking leaking stuff. I thought the officer had a good control to go down there. Oh, he got a scanner. That's why he knew he was coming. <laughs> I'm a journalist. Journalists have scanners. <laughs> right? I mean, that's what journalists do. We have scanners. We know what's going on. I'm, this this is constitutionally protected activity, safeguarded by the First Amendment. I have every right to do this. You from Florida? I'm not answering any questions. Because if you're from Florida, you should know that Florida also requires everybody to have identification, which is state law. So you have to have identification on you mm -hmm. at all times. Mm -hmm. It's state law. Look it up. He's a lieutenant in the sheriff's office. Yeah. Why are you doing so that, sir? Who uh, I've explained to the officers. No, explain it to me. And I'm explaining to you what I'm doing is I'm a journalist gathering content for story. Uh, investigative journalist gathering content for story. And beyond that, right investigative journalists gather con content for a story. And if I'm not being detained, I'm not going to produce any ID. It's none of y'all's business who I am. It's none of y'all's business why, what I'm doing. It's an investigative story. You need to produce something. Don't tell me it's none of my business. You had to take pictures of a correctional facility. That's right. And we want to know why. And I was taking pictures of the inmates, right? I've just explained why? to you why. I'm an investigative journalist gathering content but for a story. But the investigative journalist ID as well. This is my identification. A number I can call, a number I can call, or uh, something. Like I said, it's none of your business. Unless I'm being detained, I'm not producing the ID. And if, as a matter of fact, if I'm free to go, have a nice day. Am I free to go? No, 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 no. No, you're not free to go. I'm not free to go. No, so sir. I'm being detained. No, sir. I need to see some ID. Okay. Well, if I'm not being detained, have a nice day. I need to see some ID. Sir. I'm either being detained or I'm free to go. Either you're, one. you're actually um, committing obstruction right now by not giving us an ID. Okay, what's going to happen if I don't produce ID at this point? What will happen? 
I'm, on the I'm not. I'm not refusing. Or standing on the sidewalk. He, he, was, he, was, he was alleged to have been in the parking lot. Now, I, right. I personally we didn't see it. I don't. I mean, I, I didn't see it, so I don't know. When I came out and, and, and counted him, he was on the side. Am I being detained? I'm free to go. It's one or the other. No, I need just my deed. Officer. Right, I'm sorry, officer. Lieutenant. He got this off YouTube. Exact same subject, did this exact same thing on YouTube. Right, this is comical. And then this he wants is, to write about it, and this is at. It's because you guys are, are infringing on my First Amendment rights. This is a public sidewalk. This is constitutionally protected activity. I've explained to you that I'm a journalist. And you never, you and never you were set not, foot off the sidewalk? I have never set foot off the sidewalk. You would have an ID tag. You would have something. I do have detail. an ID tag, but what I'm telling you is it's none of your business. I'm not producing ID unless I'm being detained. For this security is purposes, yes. Sir, there's did. also a gentleman. He recorded down yeah, he's, he's recording right down the road. Yeah, he has a camera Am I free to go? No, you're not free to go. So I'm being detained? You, you're not free Let to go? go ahead and I'm not free to go. Down. Okay, this is not a public building. That's not a public building. It's, it's not it's a, a state correctional institution, man. Okay, You're Tiffany and for Parsons. Secure, yes, Tiffany Parsons. What's your badge number? 37, Gadsden County Sheriff's Office. Thank you. Phone number 627 okay, And if you need anything relax. further, I can give okay, it to you. Relax. This is a security issue because. This is a First Amendment issue. Here. This is a constitutionally protected right safeguarded by the First Once Amendment. Once you come off the sidewalk, it's a security I've never been issue. off the sidewalk. Have you seen me off the sidewalk? Have you I, witnessed I me on their property? I can videotapes. Can Go you request a it. sergeant or a lieutenant and let's just view the I videotapes? Have, I, I have my chief of security in route. Okay, because if you step I foot never off, stepped the sidewalk, off the sidewalk, we have a big issue. I never, foot, never stepped foot off the sidewalk. I've been on the sidewalk the whole time. If I'm free to go, have a nice day. You're not free to go. So I'm being detained. Temporarily. For what reason? What's what's your reasonable articulable because I'm suspicion? I'm conducting an investigation. Based on what? What am I doing? That's I'm illegal. I'm conducting an investigation. What's your and reasonable? My badge says that I can. What's your reasonable and articulable you will suspicion? Be quiet. What is your reasonable I'm articulable suspicion? I'm conducting an investigation. Based on I'm what? I'm conducting an investigation based on a, a potential security issue. Potential security Potis issue. Potential security issue. That's I've, right. I've explained until to you. Until I see the tapes. I have right to see the tapes, and after I see the tapes... So you're going to detain you, me until you see the tapes? Can you shut up long enough for me to finish talking? Well, that's not very nice. I don't give a damn. Okay. Until I see the videotapes, I am officially conducting an investigation. Once I view them, mm -hmm. and I see that you never step foot on this property, you are free to go. What's your reasonable articulable suspicion that I step foot on that property? What's your reasonable articulable suspicion that I've committed a crime? Did you take an oath to uphold and defend the Constitution of the United States, ma'am? Are you aware that this is a First Amendment right? Are you remaining silent? I am pleading my fifth. How about that? <laughs> Isn't that great? That's great. Well, I can't drive because I have nerve damage. Um, we've got your white vehicle from St. John's County, and I have all of your driver's license information. Your license is, in fact, disqualified. Mm -hmm. um, now that I have both of your information, the warden of this property wants you officially trespass. Do both parties understand and acknowledge that you are trespassed from this property sure. from this point forward? I have a property receipt for you, sir, because your phone was found and I'm turning it over to you. Okay. Here is your property receipt. Glad to get that back to you. Glad we could identify both of you. You have officially been trespassed from the property again. I'm iterating that for the yes, second, as well. third, and fourth Me? time. Have you are trespassed, Mr. Thomas James Covenant and Mr. Jeffrey Gray from St. John's County, St. Augustine. You're trespassed as well. Okay. okay? I understand. Okay. Thank you for work. So go ahead and go back to your car and put the keys in there. I'm going to stand right here on the sidewalk and take pictures until I'm done.